In this video, I want to share with you guys the microfiber towels that I'm using right now to protect car paint that's in really good condition, and in this particular situation, black paint. What's going on? Glad you guys are here, and welcome back to the Wilson Auto Detailing community. If you are new here and you love everything auto detailing, then consider subscribing. So before we do anything, let me just show you guys the car that I'm working on right now and the condition of the paint. So obviously, this is a Porsche 911 Turbo, all right? And basically, what I want to show you guys is the paint in the sun here because it's in extremely good condition and you can see that while there are some swirls and there are some imperfections and maybe you can pick it up in the camera I'll try to get the sun to hit it so you can see sun hitting the paint right there while there are some swirls it is super super minimal and this is actually what they're calling optic paint right now it's uh, kind of a paint that has like a glittery aspect to it I guess is the best way I can describe it so yes there are defects just like any car that has ever been driven in the history of the universe however the defects are very very minimal and not to mention it's black paint so should there be any defects put into the paint it's going to be very very easy to see and so kind of the point I want to make here is talk about the number one thing that I think we kind of miss in the detailing world of actually what causes imperfections that we don't talk about very much much and that is microfiber towels. So the specific microfiber towels that I'm going to be highlighting in this video that I've been using for the past several months and loving and have quickly kind of become my favorite because of the uh, price and how basically well they work and the different ways that I use them are the Max Shine microfiber towels. This particular one I believe is their Zero Crazy. It's got an edge actually to it and we'll talk about it more later. In this bucket I filled up with ONR and distilled water solution and I have about three different towels in here. I believe they're 16 by 24 inches and they are their ultra plush microfiber towels, all right? They're super wet and dripping. I want to talk to you guys as I do this hood to kind of better explain what I'm doing here and a few nuances that I don't think we're really talking about. Okay, so like I said, this hood is in really, really good condition. The whole paint, the whole car paint is in really, really good condition. This is the first stage of me addressing the paint here and I'm only going to be addressing the hood here, but I want to show you guys step by step how I go from from kind of the funnel, what I say, most general to most detailed, and the microfibers I'm using. So, to start off, obviously here, you can see I'm using this microfiber towel. I believe, again, it's called their Ultra Plush, or something of the sort like that. And, uh, of course, I'll hook it up in the YouTube description box below. Now, it's dripping wet, you can see. I'm gonna fold it, actually, into fourths, and it's a huge surface. You guys can see here, there's some sort of coating on this paint already. The water's beating off very easily. However, Basically what I want to do here is I'm going to start down here at the bottom. I'm using the character lines of the car uh, to kind of tell me where I'm going to wash first and dry first, all that sort of stuff. So I'm separating the hood based on where the hood very literally is separated. I'm only doing that area. This is a sort of Gary Dean method here that I'm using, but you guys can see I'm just letting the pressure and the weight of the towel itself kind of do the work for me, so I'm not putting any pressure down. I'm just going to be dragging it kind of across the paint to take any of that surface dirt off. Now, many guys end up messaging me and they're wondering why am I getting swirls in my car paint? And nine times out of 10, I'm asking what microfiber towels are you using? And I don't really know why we don't talk about it very much, at least in the online detailing space that I can see, but the microfiber towels that you are using when you are cleaning car paint, probably, this is my opinion, but they have more power to scratch your paint than basically anything else does. We always talk about the two bucket wash method and your mitt and all that sort of stuff, but again, the microfiber towels you're using are probably part of the issue here. You guys can see there's not a ton of dirt on this paint. You can see it picked up a little bit here, but again, it's just very, very simple. Picked up a little uh, piece, of, piece of dirt there, but again, very, very straightforward. Now, as I dry the paint, I'm using the Max Shine Zero Crazy, and it's got an edge here to it. There's edgeless ones as well. This one, I believe, is 16 inches by 16 inches, and I'm just very, very gently letting it run across the paint. It's super absorbent. Alrighty, just like this. Again, this part is very straightforward. And this is kind of the first part of the paint cleaning process that I use here. So not only am I not putting a bunch of pressure down, but more than that, 
these particular towels are ultra plush towels. They're very, very, very soft. Not to mention they've been washed probably four times now and they're still, the microfiber are still intact. Basically, a lot of you guys know I'm, I'm a big proponent of the Costco towels, the Kirkland brand, because they are a really good towel to have on hand because they're more or less disposable in my opinion. So car paint like this, if I'm polishing it, I might pull out a totally new Kirkland microfiber towel and go ahead and remove the polish that way. That way I know the towel's never been used, all that sort of stuff. However, at some point, especially when you're dealing with higher end vehicles, you are going to have to have some high quality microfiber towels that aren't necessarily bought in bulk like I'm a huge proponent of and these have been washed again three to four times now and both the zero crazy and these ultra plush towels that I'm using to actually wash the paint itself not only is, is allowing me to avoid using a mitt which in a lot of ways I kind of like because a mitt gets used over and over and over again and like I said the one thing that probably has more potential to scratch your car paint than anything else is going to be the applicator you're using the microfiber the mitt and so I like to have microfibers that I don't use every single time it kind of gives me some variance so I'm not using the same applicator to wash car paint every single time and washing it and degrading those microfibers and eventually kind of starting to scratch the paint without even realizing it. So what I want to do here is go ahead and wash the rest of the front as including the uh, windshield and then bring you guys in uh, for a couple more notes here after I get done with that. Okay, so I went ahead and just did the front here, and of course there's a ton of bugs and whatnot, and you're gonna see there's gonna be rock chips, and I'm actually gonna address the bugs here in a second. However, basically, the two quick steps that I did is, number one, took my O&R drenched uh, ultra plush towel from Max Shine, and took off all that surface dirt there, and of course any bugs that kind of came off very lightly. Then I took a little uh, soft detailing brush, and got a little all-purpose cleaner, and I just cleaned these black trim pieces down here as well, in here a little bit, and on the other side, and got into all this cracks and crevices and then of course dried with my zero crazy towel there now my point here is that all of that was done so gently and so gosh what would I say controlled and that's fantastic you can do that in any situation with any microfiber towel the problem is even at times when you are controlled and doing things gently if you are not careful you will still put swirls in because of the microfiber towel you are using. And so I wanna come out with a few more videos on microfiber towels, particularly highlighting the Max Shine because I do really like them and they're basically doing just what I need them to do. So now I'm gonna go ahead and hit the windshield, of course. I'm gonna flip it to a new side and I always wash the windshield before I clay it. You wanna take off any surface dirt that you can so that you're not, you can you know, obviously scratch glass just like you can paint. So I'm do this side. I'm also gonna get down here just in this black trim that you can see that's really obvious. Alrighty. Then I'm gonna take my Zero Crazy Plush microfiber towel and come down here. My point with all this really is fairly simple in that you can be the best detailer in the world, but if you don't have certain fundamental things in place, you're still gonna really hurt paint like this. So what I wanna go ahead and do is wash the entire car, wax the entire car with not the same towels, but the same version of the towel, but of course they'll be dry. And then I wanna come in afterwards and show you guys the end result. All right, so it's pulled into the garage now, so you can't see it in the sun, but I'll just do a quick little once over here. Basically my point here is the one thing that probably affects scratching paint more than anything else is the applicator you're using to clean that paint, to protect that paint, being microfiber towels. And in this case, I use these really plush microfiber towels from Max Shine because they end up working really really well I can put pressure when I need to and they're not going to dig into the paint or scratch the clear coat on a car like this it becomes very obvious when you do something like that and that's why I basically avoid using what I would call more disposable bulk uh, lower quality towels pretty much at all costs so here's that finished result 
And there you go. So if you guys are new to the Wilson Auto Detailing community, definitely consider subscribing if you love everything auto detailing. And if you want to check out the microfiber towels I was using here, definitely check those out in the YouTube description box below. There'll be Amazon links, and if you use my links, it does give this channel a small commission, but it helps this channel stay alive so I can keep putting out content just like this. As always, thank you guys so much for being involved here, and from Luke here at Wilson Auto Detailing, keep working hard, and I'll see you guys in the next video.